city of Elife in Oshun State, Nigeria, witnessed yet another historic event as Sir Dr. Kersington Adebu Kola Adebutu was majestically installed as the Adoli Udwa, while her two pretty and amiable jewels, Dame Caroline Adebutu and Yeye Kofurola Adebutu, were installed as Yeye Mode Udwa and Yeye Rewa Udwa, respectively. The two-day event, which took place on the 18th and 19th of October 2019, saw a large number of prominent personalities from across the world who came all out to felicitate with this great pace setter of our time, Sir Dr. Kessington Adebu Kuala Adebutu. It is worthy of note that the prestigious Odole Udua Chieftaincy title is the first of such confirmance by the 51st Orni his Imperial Majesty, Oba Adeyeye Nitogunsi, or Jaja II. The traditional chieftaincy title of the Odoli Udwa is one of the biggest titles in Ileife and Yoruba land. It is a special office which works closely with the Oni in rallying the descendants of Ududua wherever they are in the world for unity, peace, and progress of the Yoruba race. The highly revered chieftaincy position in Yoruba land was pioneered by the great Aramio while he was still a prince of Ife, after which the late chief of Bafemi Awolowo and chief G.O. Kiajai stepped into the shoes. This makes Sir Dr. Kessington Adebu Kola Adebutu the third Ogun indigen to be installed or Dole Udua. It is without an iota of doubt that the title fits and sits well with the age-long philanthropic disposition of Sir Dr. Kessington Adebu Kuala Adebutu, C.O.N. In attendance at the ceremony were the Oni of Ife and Chief Host, His Imperial Majesty, Oba Adeyeye Nitogunse, the Ashuaju of Ife, Chief Oyekule Alex Duriemi, billionaire industrialist and the area of Lagos, Chief Razaka Koneokoya and wife, Chief Mrs. Shadi Okoya, elder statesman, Chief Ayuade Banjo, Son of the celebrant Honorable Ladi Adebutu, former governor of Ogun State, Chief Ulushegon Shoba. Others were the Irelukuti of Lagos, Irelabiola Dusumu, former permanent secretary, Dr. Lai Ogubambi, two time minister, Chief Mrs. Nikia Akonde, CON, the chairman and CEO, Biscon Communications, Prince Basil Atilo, the CEO and publisher of Ovesha International, Bashanru Dele Momodu. Leading the long list of traditional rulers who came in their legion for the ceremony were their Karibo and paramount ruler of Remo, His Royal Majesty, Oba Babatunde Ajayi, the Alakbero of Ikberu Remo, Oba Adeliki do Ubasibo, the Ayogmure of Ikurudu, His Royal Majesty, Oba Kabiru Shotobi, the Ebomawe of Agoiwe, His Royal Majesty, Oba Abdurazak Adenuba, the Alekbe of Ekbe, Oba Adewale Shiberu, among other distinguished guests. The first phase of the ceremony saw the good people of Ife file out in their numbers to warmly receive Sir Dr. Kersington Adebu Kuala Adebutu as he made his way into the city. <laughs> He 
stopped briefly at the Ife Grand Resort and Leisure, where he entertained few of his guests before proceeding to the palace of the Orni to pay homage. A short prayer was said by all the guests in attendance for the peaceful reign of Sir Dr. Kersington Adebukola Adebutu as the Odole Udwa. <laughs> After which guests made their way to the construction site where the multi-millionaire state-of-the-art Udua Heritage Home will be built. At the site, the first block for the structure was laid by Sir Dr. Kessington Adebukola Adebutu. In the remarks of His Imperial Majesty, Oba Adeyeyeni Togunzi, he expressed delight at the project being sponsored by Sir Dr. Kessington Adebukola Adebutu which he said will harbor the historic artifacts of the Yoruba race, as well as give the younger generation the opportunity to know their history. <laughs> Later on, the Oni give a brief historic account of the title being bestowed on Sir Dr. Kessington Adebu Kola Adebutu. He ended with prayers. Sir, <laughs> <laughs> Sir Kessington Adebu Kuala Adebutu took time out to appreciate the gesture shared on him and noted that the Odole Udua chieftaincy title being bestowed on him was not bought or given to him due to the project he intends to embark on, but out of the Orni's goodwill. Number one. <laughs> <laughs> the architects who will supervise the construction of the multi millionaire Udua Heritage House, Akogun Kola Nodikbe, took the audience through the structural details of the building, which is supposed to have a special office for the Oni, an event venue, administrative department, and other facilities. 
The building is earmarked to be unveiled within the period of one year, and not less than 2,000 people will work on it. The project was later unveiled by Honorable Ladi Adibutu alongside other dignitaries, which brought that part of the event to an end. To the glory of God, the benefit of mankind, and the Yoruba people in particular, we open this in the name of the Father, in the name of the Son, and in the name of the Holy Ghost. The second phase of the celebration, which was held on the 19th of October 2019, witnessed a very high turnout of A-list dignitaries who stormed the great land of Ife to celebrate with Sir Dr. Kersington Adebukwala Adebutu as he added the father of all feathers to his prestigious chieftaincy cap, the Odoli Udua, which Sir Dr. Kersington Adebukwala Adebutu has said would be his last chieftaincy title. Leading the rich entourage of dignitaries was the Vice President of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, Professor Yemi Shibajo, former President Chief Ulushago Basenjo, GCFR, the Honorable Minister of Interior, Ogbeni Rauf Arigbeshola, who came with a message from the President, Governor of Ogun State, Prince Dakwabiodo, Governor of Lagos State, Mr. Babajide Saolu, Deputy Governor of Edo State, Mr. Philip Shuaibo, former Chief of General Staff, retired Lieutenant General Oladik Bodia, former Deputy Governor of Lagos State, Elijah Sinotu Jikutu, Senator Kufu Rola Bokno Akerele, Otumba Femi Pedro, Senator Luremi Tinumbu, Ambassador Dr. Tokumba Wolowadusumu, Minister of Youth and Sports, Mr. Sunde Akindari, Wife of the Minister of Works and Housing, Dema Bimbola Fashola. Frontline politician, Senator Florence Itagiwa. Retired Assistant Inspector General of Police, Chief Tunja Lakwini. Chief Mrs. Nikia Konde, CON. Lagos businesswoman, Princess Tony Kolade, among other distinguished guests who were present at the first phase of the ceremony. Indeed, Sir Dr. Kersington Adebu Kuala Adebutu left no stone unturned to make sure that he looked his best at the event. The founder of the popular Babai Jabu Luto stepped in in grand style with a 2019 Rolls Royce Phantom with customized number plates that read Odoli. The Rolls Royce worth over 169 million naira is a special gift to himself as he gets one of the biggest chieftaincy titles in Yoruba land, Odoli Udua. The vehicle was used to convey Sir Dr. Kersington Adebu Kuala Adebutu to the palace of the Oni, but as tradition demands, midway to the palace, he rode on a white horse into the palace of the Oni. <laughs> A 
private consultation with the army, His Imperial Majesty Oba Adeyeye Nitogunsi or Jaja II, he proceeded to the temple of Oromiyo, the pioneer Odoli Udwa, where the traditional rites and activities were performed. After the traditional rites came the rains, which many people believe was a sign of blessing and acceptance of Sir Dr. Kersington Adebukwala Adebutu as the Odoli Udwa. Sir Kersington Adebutu thereafter proceeded to the palace of the army for the installation proper. The reception party, which followed next, kicked off with the national states and Ife anthems, after which Agbeni Rauf Arigbeshola delivered the goodwill message of President Muhammadu Buhari. The president congratulated Sir Dr. Kersington Adebukola Adebutu and prayed that his reign as the Odoli Udwa will be peaceful and successful. This was immediately followed by the remarks of Honorable Ladi Adibutu, who assured the army of their continuous and tireless support in working hand in hand with him for the growth of the entire Yoruba race. He also took time to appreciate all who contributed to the success of the program. He has created for us a fantastic heritage and by his being today, we are where we are today. Baba, Aki, Aki, I want Yahweh, you know, talk to you, but we, Dave Caroline, I like you, I do with you, Aki, my own, Yeye Mode, Odua, Yeye Mode, Odua. Adufi, 
Other events that followed in quick successions were the remarks of the chairman, planning committee of the event, Are Kolao Yefeso, and the celebrant's special Odoli dance. It was merriment till the very end as King Sonia Day and his band dished out very good danceable tunes, which saw guests taking turns to hit the dance floor. <laughs> From the chairman and CEO of Biscon Communications, Prince Bishol Atilo, who was a member of the planning committee of the event and the main master of ceremonies at all the events, it's hearty congratulations to Sir Dr. Kessentin Adebu Kuala Adebutu on his successful installation as the Odolu Dua. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> 